something comfortable and then warped the idea to engage us, Lost World finds itself... 57% even... of our budget comes from our Patreon and from the Crash Course. I was hit by the Achilles demon. Me, Sam Lincoln, Matthew, Leia, all ripped our Achilles within the same like 24 hours. So I am on the recovery arc. Now in short, this is like my sixth major injury. I'd say my sixth major athletic injury. I don't count my face burn as a athletic injury, but I've fractured my hip and detached my quad. I've torn my ACL and meniscus. I've slipped a disc. I have, oh Jesus, I start forgetting them at this point. I've hyperextended an elbow. I've had severe ankle sprains on both sides, but I don't know. Where you draw the line of major is very specific to you. I've gotten hurt a lot. And yeah, I'm familiar with the process. You know, a lot of people worry in this community that the only thing that they have in tricking is tricking, like the skills, the movement, the thing itself, but tricks are always temporary. Listen, we're all gonna get old or we're all gonna get hurt because this stuff that we're doing is legitimately risky. Like the best analogy I can give for this injury is I blew a tire. Literally, I have been training athletic, aggressive activities my entire life and not always in the most progressive ways. There's a reason I built Mastering Tricking because young me did not have Mastering Tricking. So, you know, you gotta, you gotta pay for you gotta pay your dues. And for me, this is my dues of a lifetime of parkour on concrete, of heavy impact, of a lot of my younger tumbling was on a dead mat or a layer of foam on concrete. And that's not the best for the body long term. And that's okay, that's okay. I'm surviving and I'm doing really good. Because of all of my injury experience, I'm, I feel like I'm tackling this one like a veteran. <laughs> Like, I am, if my math is right, 12 days post-surgery and 15 days post-actual Achilles tear. Let me show you guys kind of the surgery I got. I had a complete rupture. Thing just popped. You saw the video in the intro and in the clips just before this. There's like a dent in my Achilles from where it used to be. So I definitely needed surgery. Now, a natural recovery, as I have researched, is totally and was totally an option for me, but I wanted to get the strongest tendon possible and I wanted to get a decent recovery time because that does matter to me. I am trying to walk at my wedding. You know, these things matter to me as a human being. I like being able to run and, you know, comfortably move my body. But here, let me show you guys the surgery that I got. This is what I got. This is called a mini open. 
because normally the Achilles surgery that a lot of people get is instead of a horizontal cut across the side is a vertical cut down the entire tendon length. Now again, real quick, I do have to say, I'm no doctor, I'm no surgeon, I'm just a guy who's gotten hurt a lot and wants to help some people along this injury. And I'll talk a little bit more in other videos about like pain management, I got some uh, some Oxy right here, some Snoop Dogg OG. We're gonna talk about all of these things, as well as like what it feels like to go through this recovery process. But I wanna start by getting you guys super informed on what happened, where are we now? And yeah, I just had this surgery not even two weeks ago. So lateral incision right there. They're going to pull down the Achilles that is like left up. And this is actually pretty similar to my tear. My tear was a complete straight across. I think I had a little bit more stringies down there. It wasn't as like nice and pretty as this one, but yeah, very similar. They're gonna drag down the tendon and what these green lines on the screen are is threads. They're going to put a special type of threading through the top part of the tendon, pull it out using a special tool, pull it down, kinda, suture it up and make it all nice and neat. Like this was kind of a similar thing when I had my ACL done. They basically braid different sutures and different parts of your tendon to kind of help you reconnect it. Now, what are they doing down there at the bottom? They're applying two bone screws. Well, first they're drilling the holes, then they're gonna thread the, the threads through the bottom end of the tendon tie them all up nice and neat, and then anchor them in by these bone screws on the calcaneus. And yeah, this is the surgery that I got. This is kind of what they do. They pull it down, they pull it out, they snip the threads, they apply the bone screws. You know, they make you all nice and neat. And there you go, there you go. That is the surgery that I got and now I am on the recovery arc. So tomorrow is my post-op. Tomorrow I get this cast off and they let me know, is my wound infected? Is my leg looking really good? Is it not looking really good? Cause since the surgery, I have had it in this nasty looking kind of like unga bunga style cast and ooh wee, I am ready to get this thing off. I feel trapped. I feel like I, I wanna be able to walk again. Ooh wee. So yeah, I'm really excited. I'm gonna keep you guys super informed on everything on the recovery journey. I'm gonna be doing like a post MTG kind of thing because I never got to do that. Zach is working on his edit, which I'm super excited for. There's a lot coming down the line of mastering tricking. So if you guys want to be a part of this, please subscribe, turn on the bell, turn on notifications. I want to help people who have gotten injured. I want to help people who have gone through this before. And if you look at my website, I want to make a curriculum to help people learn tricking in a progressive way that is safe. So that way people don't have to deal with this in the future. I like tricking and tricking is too cool to be as lame as it is for people getting injured and pro athletes not getting paid. So yeah, there's gonna be a lot of changes to this community. I'm super excited to do the work and really help you guys. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart to everybody. If you wanna to donate to the recovery, please check the website. If you want to buy all of my eBooks for $4 because spirit of tricking, please check the website and have a lovely day. I am going to continue to do what I've been doing, which is a lot of nothing. I'm not allowed to be super productive. So I'm trying to get all this little work done as quick as I can. And my phone is like going off, you guys can't hear it. So, peace, have a lovely day. Thank you guys so much. Mm. I will heal, I will be back.